Hello everyone, welcome back to the Keep Productive YouTube channel. It's Francesco here and we're going to be talking a little bit about Bento, a brand new application that we'll be launching very soon and I'm super excited to chat with you guys about it and answer a few of your questions as well. Yeah, so this is a really weird thing. We're actually launching our own application, which is so strange, personally for me as well. Reviewing applications and then actually making them is very weird. It's sort of like um, an ice cream uh, truck scooper. The guy who scoops it, then making his own ice cream brand. <laughs> I don't know. Is it? So basically, uh, what I want to do with this video is talk through a little bit about things like the concept, uh, things like um, the actual app itself and then also dates and important information that you might want to know as well as some answer questions near the end. I've been really fortunate over the last year to be working with my good friends from university, Carl and Robin, on the actual app development side of it and it wouldn't be possible without them so I'm, I'm super excited to actually launch it with these guys um, and I'll leave their Twitters in the bio but obviously you can follow the Bento method and you'll be able to sort of keep updated with us all as well. So, um, one of the reasons why we created Bento is because, well, at least we all know there is a problem with prioritization. Um, we open our to-do lists and they tend to be like five to 10 tasks. We're all guilty of it and we sort of overload ourselves. So what we wanted to do is, is not only create an app, but a method as well that can be used to help people just hone it in and really narrow down what they're gonna be doing so that you sort of avoid that task overwhelm. So the great thing with Bento is first off is it's not really a shiny new product syndrome because it's sort of just a layer and sort of a way of working. More it is than an extra app to your system. You can still use your to-do list, you can still use Notion, you can still use all of the other apps that you might have in the old kitty, uh, but it's just a way of thinking that hopefully can change your productivity and improve it. So let's start with the concept. And very simply, it allows you to just choose three tasks to do. Now, much like a bento box, um, would you get sort of compartments in a bento box? And we've limited you to three compartments, meaning you can only do three major things across a day. And we've actually broken those compartments down, much like a bento box, where we've got a large area, a medium area, and a small area and you can pick tasks based on that. Now, when we release this, there will be a sort of full guide and full methodology in terms of which ones are best to actually align to them. However, we believe that large, medium, small will help you to get the real big projects done during the day and make you feel accomplished in your work day. Because I feel like there's not only a problem with task overwhelm of having like five or six or seven things to do in your day and feeling a bit stressed when you're looking at it, but also with the fact that when you end your day, do you feel like you've accomplished something? So hopefully we're trying to solve that. The second part of the process is actually workflows. Um, you know, the, the benefit to having a sort of three tasks in your days is helpful, but how do I go about accomplishing my day uh, with those three tasks? And we've like built on existing workflows. Um, for example, Eat That Frog, Climb That Summit, which we've made up, <laughs> Slow Burn, um, which you can apply to your bento box every single day. So for example, you want to start with a large task, move on to the medium one, then go to the small, or you find yourself a bit more suited to the other ones where you start with a small one and work your way to the large one. There's workflows that apply that. And thirdly, we wanted an app that you could focus in on stuff. So what we're doing with bento is making it very focused orientated allowing you to really zoom into even just the one task you're working on. Now itself, Bento is actually a really simple methodology and it's also a very simple app. It doesn't have all of the sort of backlog areas or over-tuned lists that you would see in other applications. Not that that's a bad thing, but we believe that we should limit you and that will help your prioritization process. Even with the boxes, they're limited to seven overall that you can create. Um, that does allow you to plan a whole week ahead. So for example, you could plan your full week ahead or you could plan your today, your goals for the week, month and year. Um, and it gives you a bit of focus on just three things that you wanna get done and also narrow down on the intensity of them. 
So I'm really, 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 really excited but also really, really, really nervous. Um, we put out last week the sign up form for this so you can sign up for early access. Basically, what we'll be doing is um, we may potentially be doing like a pre-order but for the app uh, on iOS um, and then launching Android later, but it's still undecided on how that will play out in terms of when we're gonna launch each platform. However, uh, you, if you sign up to the newsletter, you'll be able to get access to um, all the updates that we'll post out. We'll probably post one out Wednesday, actually, just to get to know everyone. Um, and I'm just really excited about putting this out. Obviously, the app itself um, is, um, we've tried to make it very relaxing, very cool. And what I wanted to do with you guys is show you a little teaser of what it looks like inside of the app. So let's run that now. So that looks really exciting, uh, <laughs> excite me at least. Um, and I'm really excited about bringing this to you guys. Um, we've done a lot of sort of nice uh, background work, helping you learn the method inside of the app through really helpful videos, and also provided uh, the download with some themes. We'll also be doing an upfront cost, um, a little bit like how um, the things system works, where you pay an upfront and you, you have access, although, if Bento tends to kick off, um, I will say this now, we probably will end up moving to a subscription or uh, or sort of making a sort of more collective uh, business plan for it. But because you, because as you can imagine, we would like to, <laughs> um, you know, be able to sort of grow it and, and, and build on it. Um, and the one thing is, um, it's, it's something that uh, we believe will help prioritization, task overload, and, and most importantly, that sort of, uh, feeling of when you finish your day, right, I've actually finished something for the day, which is something a lot of people don't tend to get. And I think it's not to do with whether, what they've done. I think it's to do with what they have to do and that sort of expectation they set themselves. Whereas I think, and hopefully, this will really make you more tuned to what you're actually doing in a day. And whilst it does look a small amount three, you're like, well, I've got three tasks to do. Hopefully the methodology can help you understand that Three is actually a really nice number for getting the amount of tasks done, and you can accomplish quite a lot in that period of time. So folks, yeah, of course, some questions um, that you guys might have, and it might be like about the dates we're releasing. Uh, we'll keep you updated here on YouTube about um, sort of uh, announcements and also on the newsletter if you wanna sign up. Um, we're hoping that we can add a beta sort of middle of February, but we're not sure, so don't quote us on that. Um, however, once you get on the beta, you'll be able to help us really fine tune the application. So we would appreciate that. Um, and we'll put out sort of general post about the beta. Um, once a beta's launched and everyone's sort of strong and happy about it, it shouldn't be too long until we publish it to the App Store officially. Um, and we'll let people know if there is a pre order as well. The other things as well is people asked some questions. How does it actually relate to the food? Well, hopefully I've answered that because um, what we want to do with Bento is actually orientated towards people packing their boxes. Um, so this doesn't actually have to only be used for your today's tasks. It could be used for your monthly goals, the three things you want to do in your month, and also for planning your week ahead. Even if you wanted to have some things that are separate, like for example, your three things you want to do today, your month goals, your team's OKRs for the month, um, and even sort of your values, that's something that you could have as well in the app. Uh, but the good thing is there's all limits to it inside there. And we do intend to sort of develop on it. Uh, we're also thinking about a feature called templates, which uh, would help people sort of, um, you know, be able to save a bit of time setting their own bento boxes up every day. So folks, I'm, I'm really excited. Um, hopefully you are. I'd love to hear some of your comments um, in, in the description below, uh, in the comments below. And of course, um, feel free to reach out to me anytime on Twitter uh, or email if you would like to uh, ask any questions. But I'm really excited and hopefully we can get this app out um, soon into the palms of your hands. Um, and uh, I'm, I'm well chuffed that we've got this far um, and, and, and produced something that I'm pretty excited about launching uh, with the guys. Anyway, guys, thank you so much. Um, please do leave any questions and I will talk to you very soon. Cheerio, folks. Bye.